Hi and welcome to the channel. So I'm making what I call hybrid aircrete today using shaving foam. So I'm looking at different formulas to make aircrete at home uh, in a domestic setting. I'm not using the generator, the foam generator, which I built, I think about a couple of years ago. So just for convenience, I'm going to try cheap shaving foam to make the aircrete. I'm adding vermiculite to the aircrete, so that's why it's a hybrid. Um, <coughs> because I'm going to be making a, a rocket stove form and testing this particular batch of aircrete in that rocket stove. So I'll split it into two videos. This is about making the actual shaving foam aircrete and then I'll do another, probably another two videos on building the uh, rocket stove form and then obviously testing it. So that I think will be two videos, one for building the form and then the second one for demolding and actually testing the aircrete itself. So these three videos are going to be linked. So of course, watch this one, but also watch the other two. So to make our aircrete, I'm going to be using some shaving foam, so really cheap shaving foam, it's about 70p in the UK, about 90 cents. About two litres of fine vermiculite, Doesn't, I don't think it really matters which grade of vermiculite you get. There's about two litres there, so you can buy this in any garden centre in small quantities. I'm going to be using some extra rapid set cement, so this is high calcium aluminate cement. I can't see any difference between this cement and cement used uh, or branded as refractory cement apart from the price so this is about half price compared to that. I'm going to need a bucket to mix with, something to mix it with as well and also some water. Right so got our litre of water. Probably put about two scoops of this in, this cement, so roughly about that size. Mix that in. Add in our vermiculite. So just looking at this, I would definitely add that, I'd probably add two litres of water, get the vermiculite cement and water to this kind of consistency before I added the shaving foam. Might as well finish the can. So it's definitely adding 
volume now to the uh, uh, crete. Definitely wasn't before. The mixture was far too dry when I added the first lot of foam in, so make sure you don't make that mistake. That's our shaving foam aircrete done. And that's thing I'm going to do is add it to our uh, rocket stove form. So click on that video to watch the rest of what happens to this. So there you go, Aircrete using shaving foam, really easy to do. Did make a few mistakes, uh, which I've obviously put a um, panel in the video to tell you that. So if you if we just have a recap, the mixture was far too dry when I added the vermiculite to the water and cement to add the uh, shaving foam. What, what happened was it just broke the shaving foam down and it stopped uh, being useful. So make sure that you add enough water to that mix so that it's actually free running not too wet though because as you add the shaving foam that adds uh, more water into the mixture uh, so just make sure it's free running then add the shaving foam a little bit at a time and then you should be good to go you do notice that it starts to add some uh, good volume to the concrete towards the end of the uh, can Thank you for watching, please subscribe to this channel and if you've enjoyed this particular video hit that like button.